Oh, I'm excited. It's finally here. Judgment Day. Let me just give you a quick background on this whole thing and what you're about to hear. It's real simple. Vinny Favali and Tom Gesimundo are guys who work at this radio station. Scratching my balls. One and, is a CBS executive. The other one is our um, financial officer. He signs your paychecks. Yeah. You're the chief's financial officer, right? Controller. 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 Okay. That's the term. So these two maniacs get together and write songs together. Hello, Which is Debbie. certainly the last thing they should be doing. And Vinny and Tom think their songs are really good. We know. And, and we started playing them on the oh. air, and, it, and, and they write the songs like this. You have been nothing but bad encouragement for them. They now have a website. Oh, yeah, I know. I know. I'll, I'll get into that. I just want to get to the contest itself. But, but here's what the tape that we got. Said it. Not even to this day. You made sure I read it. The author doesn't sign her name. You tell all your friends how I left you in haste. All right. I told Vinny and Tom is a horrible song, but I right. thought it would be a funny idea if the audience tried to make something out of this. We received thousands of entries, lots of musicians out there. And most people couldn't make anything out of it. No, no, no one could make true. it. That's yes, that true is true. No, you, <laughs> most you of the entries would be bad and they were good. Uh, and no thanks to you it. and Tom. That's why you delayed Great it a version. month. You can't handle it. They the weren't any of them very you good. You can't handle it, Robin. <laughs> we had to narrow it down to three finalists. And we have a panel, an esteemed panel, a prestigious panel. Harvey Leeds is here with us today. Harvey, of course, is a uh, record company executive. Give your credentials real quick, Harvey. Uh, senior Vice President of Artist Development at Epic Records. Worked there over 30 years uh, with lots of artists, everything from uh, Raging as Machine, Pearl Jam, new artists like Franz Ferdinand, Modest Mouse, All right. Chevelle. I would say you're an excellent judge. Charlotte. You, you I, certainly I have qualifications. Hope no music by now. <laughs> John Tita, what are your recommend? What is your uh, what is your background? I'm senior vice president at Warner Chapel Music, and I've worked with uh, Santana and Bon Jovi and Jennifer Lopez. Senior vice president of Warner Chapel Music. You're a publishing uh, firm, right? Yes. You you actually go out to songwriters and say, "Hey, you got some good songs here. We'll buy them from you, don't you?" And I go to artists and say, "I got great songs for you." All right. So I am sorry that you do have to be here today. Yeah. <laughs> well, let me tell you something. We have three finalists who turned this thing around and said, no matter how bad this song is, we will, we will prevail. First of all, let me introduce to you one of our finalists. This man is so accomplished. We are honored to have him in the, as, a, as one of the finalists. This man's name is Mr. Robert Goulet. He honors us with his presence. May I call you Mr. Goulet? Mr. You Goulet. certainly may. Yes. <laughs> Mr. Goulet, I am honored that you would even be a part of this nonsense. I tell you something, Howard. I've been looking forward to being on your show for a long time. Finally make it. Yes. And we are. We, this is a, a competition. Not that you need to compete, but uh, the fact of the matter is there's a $5,000 prize from Hemma Relief. <laughs> Which is, of course, the best at getting rid of hemorrhoids. How's that for an honor? You don't have a problem there, do you, Mr. Goulet? Not yet. <laughs> <laughs> you never know, though. After this contest, you might. <laughs> I know. <laughs> and, Mr. Goulet, you, of course, uh, were brought into the contest by a friend of yours, and that friend is here right now. He's what is the your guy name? Who actually Ernest, arranged Ernest is there? Ernest yeah. is here. Hi, Ernest. Good morning, Robin. Good morning. You are honored to be a friend of Mr. Goulet's, who, of course, uh, you know, I remember. I, I, I was, even as a kid, I'd watch you on the Merv Griffin show. Mike I'd, Douglas all yeah, the time. I remember you from Camelot, all your different uh, great songs. Howard, how old do you think Mr. Goulet is? He looks amazing. He's 45, I'd say. <laughs> yeah, he's a contemporary, right? <laughs> hey, you look real good, man. Well, thank you. How do you, you know, do it? He sounds like Sulu. <laughs> yes. Uh, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so how did you meet Robert Goulet and how did you get him in the contest? I used to do a lot of the advertising for ESPN. Right. And we did a big campaign for uh, NCAA college basketball. And we, we cast Mr. Goulet to play this uh, sort of latter-day Frank Sinatra. And he did his version of contemporary fight songs. It was a really successful campaign. It was campaign. great, yeah. We won an Emmy Award and got tons of press. So we've stayed in touch over the last few years. And tried to conspire to do more work like this. Mr. Goulet, um, were you impressed when you got the tape of this song, Restless, Restless, or were you nauseated? I didn't at first get a tape. I got a, a, a call from Ernest, and he talked to my wife, Vera, and I, and he said this wonderful poem 
was on your show, and uh, you said to have somebody try to do something with it. Yeah. And he said, we can do a song. I said, well, send me the music. He said, there is no music. <laughs> so it's only the poem. Yeah. I said, well, send me the poem. And I want to tell you, uh, these guys aren't uh, Robert Frost and T.S. Eliot. Thank you. Hey, wait a second. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. You killed my song. Vinny, by the way, Vinny disagrees with Mr. Goulet. with Mr. Goulet's uh, version of Restless Restless. Why do you have a problem with Mr. Goulet's because version? Because he missed the whole point of the song. It's what like, is the point? The point of the song is about a guy. Because I missed it, too. It's pointless. <laughs> no, it's not. It's There's about no a point. guy who keeps on losing the girl. She's restless. They all get restless. They move on. B Bob, you're singing it like, you know, you're just dumping a different girl every week, and you're just happy at the end he of the song. He is dumping a different girl but every week. I think, week. Vinny, you know, not, not to... Uh, Who's this guy? Not, not he's, to, he's not the to, guy who not created to contradict this. Is this Vinny's, nigga what? Not to con contradict Vinny's genius, but, you know, in the spirit of, like, a big band, it's always a, you know, it's a heartbreaking song, but it, the guy always sort of comes out on top. Yes. Anyway, Vinny, that was the way we interpreted it. Yeah. I, lo I loved all three of the finalist versions. Uh, Mr. Goulet, I can't wait for you to perform. Uh, do you want to meet well, the... I'll tell you something, Howard. You know, we, I, I'm not used to singing at 8 o'clock in the morning. I understand. Do you want to? Do you want to this meet? This song really doesn't require much. Do, yeah, exactly. <laughs> uh, this is, I'm coming in here right now. <laughs> yeah. Mr. It's also Goulet, nine o'clock. You uh, do you want to meet your two uh, rivals in the contest? When would this be? Right now. Believe it or not. Or would you well, rather just sing and get it over with? You can't. You don't. You want to sing uh, or just listen, get it baby. over with? You ready to sing? Uh, let me. Let me sing. Then we can talk after that. Is he All wearing right. a tux right now? Uh, Mr. Goulet yeah, I'm is it dressed. My way, Vinny. Yeah, Thank do it your you. way. You All kill right. me. Please. Let Mr. Goulet have his moment. Judges, please pay attention to the performance. <laughs> Here it is, Restless Restless. You wore your purple dress. I put on my dancing shoes. And I like all the rest. I didn't have a clue. I picked you up at ten, and to a fault, you were quiet. I didn't know it then, but I guess I was off your diet. You said you needed time to think for yourself, while all the time you were thinking about somebody else. Now I can tell by the look that's on your pretty face, someone else. Taking my place. What's his name? What's his name? What's, What's his, his name? name? Restless, restless. It happens all the time. I like you. <laughs> restless, restless. I think I'm gonna change my mind. I changed my mind. Restless, restless. She starts to feel that way. I like you. You used to leave her. Restless, now you leave restless. her with nothing to say. You never said it. Not even to this day. I mean, I made sure you made sure I read it. The author doesn't sign her name. You tell all your friends how I left you in such haste. But you don't dare to tell them how you left me with this aftertaste. Yeah. It happens all the time. I think I'm gonna change my mind. She starts to feel that way. You used to leave her. Now you leave her with nothing to say. Nothing to say. Howie, baby. My professional life tonight. But my personal life ain't nothing but a two. Oh. Look at you. Thank you. You could take that crap song and make it sound oh. so good. That's the test of a real man. We have yeah. a winner. Boy, I tell you, that was great. Now it's that time. That was heavy lifting. Mr. Goulet, great <laughs> job. I'm not going to even talk to the judges yet. I'm going to bring in the second version of Restless Restless to perform live right here in our studio. This gentleman's name is Jeff. Hello, Jeff, do you have a last name or are you just going by Jeff? Stillman. Jeff Stillman. Jeff Stillman, you are going to do the honky tonk version. We look forward to uh, listening to this. How long did it take you to uh, come up with this arrangement? About uh, 15 to 20 minutes. All right. You know, Mr. And what did you think of the song? Well, because it took so short a time to come up with the music, I thought it was a very well-crafted lyric huh. as far as structure. Oh. 
Oh. Really? Thank, Thank you, Jeff. What? Uh, it's, it's suggesting okay, you need a tumor. Okay, okay. Yeah. Sucking up. Ah! <laughs> you, you could learn from this do, guy. Do, do you have, uh, do you have uh, a professional background in music? No, but for the last year or so, I've been trying to be a professional songwriter. This is what trying I to meet people like right. John okay. in the business. Right. Trying to pass my songs off. All right. Let uh, <laughs> us and Mr. Goulet hear his uh, next uh, entry and his competitor. This is Restless, Restless, Honky Tonk Version. You're going to play it off a of CD, too. All right. Here's oh, your, he's not uh, performing live? He is. He's performing live. It's karaoke, Tom and Vinny. There we go. You wore your purple dress, I put on my dancing shoes. A night like all the rest, I didn't have a clue. I picked you up at ten, and to a fault, you were quiet. I didn't know it then, but I was off your diet. Ooh, you said you needed time to think for yourself. While all the time you were thinking about somebody else Now I can tell by the look that's on your face That someone else has taken my place What's his name? What's his name? What's his name? Restless, restless happens all the time I love you, I love you, I like you, I've changed my mind Restless, restless, she starts to feel that way You used to leave her breathless, breathless Now you leave her with nothing to say <laughs> uh, Nothing to say Robin's Come on, panties Robin. are off <laughs> Why you want to hurt me like that, Robin? You never said it, not even to this day, but you made sure I read it. The author doesn't sign a name. You tell all your friends how I left you in haste, but you don't tell them how you left me with this aftertaste, left me with this aftertaste. Restless, restless, happens all the time. I love you, I love you, I like you, I've changed my mind Restless, restless, she starts to feel that way You used to leave her breathless, breathless Now you leave her with nothing to say Nothing to say No, nothing to say Oh, uh, you got nothing to say. Wow. Boy, Robin, your that panties was. came off and Great. sung to uh, Robin that, Covers. That was good. Fantastic. That uh, was do you, good. You, you, you say, though, that what do you do for a living? How do you make money? Well, for eight years, I worked at Chrysler and saved up a nice nest egg. Uh -huh. I also have a wonderful wife who is still working and suggested that for a year or two, I take some time off. Right. She believes in you. Yeah, she's uh, got to support me. Well, I tell you, it's not easy to follow Mr. Robert Goulet. M Mr. Goulet, what did you think? Well, I couldn't hear the music. I can only hear him. Really? Uh, well, I, I haven't. <laughs> Scott? I thought, I thought what he did was, was, quite, was quite good. Well, I tell Thank you, Mr. Goulet. Heard, you once know. again, our technical capabilities astound <laughs> everyone. Um, the, the, the third guy. And, and what a great, here's a guy, not even a professional, he, he took that Restless Restless and made it, uh, yeah. made it special. Our third guy is Kevin, and he did sort of a country ballad version of Restless Restless. He is the third contestant. Our judges are all here from the record companies and Vinny and Tom who wrote the song. And this is Kevin. Kevin, what's your last name? Remick. Kevin, are you a professional singer? No, I'm not. What, I, um, how I, old a guy are you? 23. 23. Uh, I was astounded by your entry. Yeah, and I'm astounded by his youth. I thought he would be older. Yeah, you seem like, you, you, are you a, a, do you want to be a country singer? Um, I play in a rock band, actually. Uh -huh. And um, wow. I thought the, the country fit the lyrics. Right. Better. Yeah, yeah, I felt like that was the feel of the song. Uh-huh. Well, uh, and you got a little bit of a band here with you. You got a backup singer, and you got a bass player, and you got your guitar. Do you need to sit down, or are you going to stand and do I'll this? Stand. You're going to stand That's and do fine, this. Yeah. And, and 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 what do you what do you do uh, aside from a rock band? How do you make a living? I I used to plaster. I just quit. You're a, pl and you're a plaster. I'm, I'm going to deliver meat. 
You're going to deliver meat. <laughs> yeah. And when you heard Vinny and Tom's song, did you think, oh, my God, this is a horrible song. I can't do a thing with it. Or did it come to you right away? Uh, uh, it was kind of, I didn't think it flowed very well. I right. just, you agonized, uh, didn't you? You agonized. <laughs> and I it, worked on it for yeah, a little Yeah, but it worked while. out for And you. even though you're in a rock band, you were able to listen to this and come up with this country version. Well, I, when I learned to play guitar, I was actually, I learned to play country from my father. Okay. And you're from Boston, I take it, with that yes. accent? Yeah, okay. <laughs> I hope. <laughs> yeah. All right, now uh, I'm going to ask you to do your version, and then we're going to okay. ask the judges to say who wins the $5,000 from Hemorrhage Relief. Good luck, Kevin, and here we go. You wore your purple dress I put on my dancing shoes A night like all the rest I didn't have a clue I picked you up at ten And to a fault you were quiet I didn't know it then That I was off your diet Said you needed time to think for yourself Well, all the time you were thinking about somebody else Now I can tell by the look that's on your face Someone else has taken my place What's his name? What's his name? What's his name? Restless, Restless. It happens all the time I love you, I love you, I like you, I've changed my mind. Restless, restless, she starts to feel that way. You used to leave her breathless, and now you leave her with nothing to say. You never said it, not even to this day. You made sure I read it, the author doesn't sign her name. You tell all your friends how I left you in haste You don't tell them how you left me with this aftertaste Restless, Restless. It happens all the time I love, you. I love you I like you I've changed my mind Restless, Restless. Starts to feel that way. You used to leave her breathless. breathless, and now you leave her with nothing to say. Wow! Yeah. Great wow. job! Wow. Yeah. Nice job! That is. Uh, I love that little. I love that guitar riff you do. That. Yeah. You know, I'm a little depressed that the most talented guy in the room is going to be delivering meat in a week. Yeah. <laughs> Rich, you're on the air. Go ahead. Yeah, hi. Uh, this is Rich. I wanted to find out if the uh, Robert Goulet version is going to be available on CD for sale. That's great. I don't, Mr. Goulet, any chance you'd be releasing this uh, for sale? This gentleman wants to buy it. Please say yes. I think I'm making a, a CD soon because of your promotion of this song. A gentleman has asked me to do uh, about a dozen of the top rock and pop songs of the last 15 years. Really? Oh, From wow. Sting and, 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 uh, and The Boss and, and Madonna and Elton John. And you're and saying... I'm going to do it in my inimitable fashion. And, and you're and saying... I think we'll be, selling, we'll be selling this one at the same time. And you're saying Tom and Vinny's song would actually appear on this CD. Only no. if they're nice to me. Only, okay. <laughs> well, I got to tell you, all you have to admit, Mr. Goulet, someone who's been around in the business a long time, all of these songs are terrific, aren't they? I think so. I think yeah. that last one was great. Yeah, Especially it's... judging from the material you started with. <laughs> yes, I know all of you started with, with mud, 
the dirt. Yes. <laughs> on the bulletin board, they say polishing a turd. Polishing a turd is what they call it. Oh, the first time you talked in 20 years, that's what you said. <laughs> you were with me, not with them. I know that this has uh, Vinny and Tom are now furiously writing songs. This has actually yeah, inspired you guys. We launched a website. Yes. That's the one bad part about no, the no, whole thing. Yeah, the only negative to the contest is, is that they're going to continue they're going to continue write. writing songs. <laughs> right. Ripthemusic.com. I was hoping this would put an end to it. All right. So here are our three contestants. Mr. Robert Goulet. Jeff. I wish I had your last name. No one will tell me. Stillman. And Kevin. Remick. Remick. Okay. All of these versions, great. I have to say, I am blown out by the talent yes. on this show. Yes. Do you have, Howard, do you have a choice of your own? I, yeah. I'm having a hard... Steve, what is your choice? I just... Kevin Remick just thick butt. Kevin no Remick, ask, he no was great. Now, is, that, is that Robert Goulet in your studio, or is that William Robert Goulet, Goulet is here, Kevin Remick is here, and Jeff Stillman. Jeff Stillman is here. All of them good. Did you see Vinny mouthing the words along with the hey, song? I, I thought I was that watching. was the creepiest oh, thing I've seen. I just, and can, at just, one point threw a kiss to Robin. Oh, I think to Robin. I hope it was to me. Yeah, Jeff right. was singing to me. <laughs> all right, it's time to go to the judges. None of our opinions count. Mr. Goulet, Kevin, and Jeff all doing a great job. And by the way, uh, Kevin, your backup singer there, Mark, terrific yes. job, right, man. Thanks. Really good. good. So I'm having some trouble with his headphones and still prevailed. And uh, Dwayne on bass guitar, nice job. Great. Wow. I'm looking at the phones. I yeah. see half the people saying Mr. Goulet's version was the best. I see another half saying that um, that Kevin's was the best. And then there seems to be another half that says Jeff was a the best. A half and a half and a half? <laughs> a half and a half and a half. No, I really do. I, I, I see. Uh, this, I could go through them all on the phone and... I've actually gotten many letters for, for actually to hear these on some sort of release. So let's go to Harvey Leeds. You heard Harvey's credentials. He's certainly qualified to judge this. What is the best version for the $5,000 prize? Well, first of all, when I first heard this song, I thought it was like a joke. It I was, it, yes. Yeah, I thought it was like Lilo Sobietsky's, you know, poems. I, I, oh, didn't, yeah. I didn't know how quite to what? interpret it. Okay, go ahead. People um, running. <laughs> also, when you hear a song... You say, could that song be a hit? Like we were talking before, could something stupid, if you, the first time you heard that, or Louie Louie or Bohemian Rhapsody, would you said, is that a hit record? Right. So I was kind of jaded, like, w w this song is really terrible. Right. Okay. <laughs> Just to get that out. But, What's right, right, I, I had to get that out. Okay. All right. So, All right. right. You've insulted the songwriters long <laughs> enough. Well, uh, I mean, you know, <laughs> at first the lyrics were, were zero. <laughs> right. You know. But All three of these gentlemen have done something. The, we absolutely. Admit. Uh, they've created very, some kind of magic here. Very impressive. Okay. But, but very I impressive. have to look at it and say, okay, who is contemporary? Who could go out there in front of an audience in the year 2004? What, you know, radio is available to it? And, okay. and I got to tell you, Kevin, hands above everyone, wins. You're saying he could sell that song? Absolutely. Wow. All right. I thought it was great. Harvey Leeds, thank you for your opinion. And Kevin, you have one vote closer to the $5,000 prize from Hammer Relief. <laughs> <laughs> we get no relief. Hey, where am I supposed you can to get, get some him Where relief. do I get five grand from? You're going to get five G's from All some right. ass Let's medicine. Let's go to the great John Tita. <laughs> Thank you, Howard. Certainly a publishing legend. Go ahead. Well, everyone was great. Mr. Goulet, you were fantastic. Um, I couldn't agree more. This is, to me, what Johnny Cash did with the Nine Inch Nails song. Oh. Mr. Goulet has come along and... And, um, Jeff, you were great, but I, my vote is going to have to be for Kevin also. Really? For Kevin? Yeah. Yeah. He did it's his over. best to distract us from those lyrics. Okay. That's what I said was good about the song. If you didn't pay attention to the lyrics, it was better. Right, Rob. I actually wanted, I'd, I'd buy that version. Yeah. I was singing along to it. Yeah, you were dancing. I was dancing. <laughs> you know, I put people together to collaborate all the time. All right. And this okay. would be well, a successful collaboration. It looks like Kevin's going to win the, uh... The uh, five, five G's, uh, Mr. Goulet. I happen to agree when I John love your when John Tita says that you have taken this song and done what Johnny Cash did for Nine Inch Nails. I was blown out when I heard your version. Yeah. And I can't thank you enough for doing that. And I and I hope you do put it out commercially. And Howard, that he did it live too. I yes. mean, yeah, I thought that was studio trickery. Very cool. Yeah. But, uh, Very cool. Awesome. Real deal. 
awesome job. And I want well, to I thank you. I had a wonderful time doing it. It was a lot of fun, and I'm glad for Kenny, and, and good luck to him. And Mr. Goulet, would you come into the studio uh, when you put out your CD uh, so we can play that with you here? Or do something I'm live send for you us. The first one. All right, thank you, Mr. Goulet. I'll tell you, I'm happy for Kenny thank as you. well. And what is it, Gary? You know, we have to thank uh, WBTV3 CBS affiliate in uh, in Charlotte because they lent us their studio. Yeah, and Mr. Goulet, what an honor. Yeah, Mr. Goulet's on tour. Thank He's you, doing sir. Camelot. Yeah. Oh, hey, you are. Yeah. So Kevin's the winner. If you want me to uh, play the uh, the female leading Camelot, just contact my <laughs> agent. <laughs> I'm pretty good. And does Mr. Goulet realize he sends you a Christmas card every year? He doesn't even know that. I bet. <laughs> you know, I get your Christmas oh, I card. Think I do. You do know. That. How old is that picture? <laughs> hey, Benny. <laughs> How bad it. is that? He song? looks too good. <laughs> Mr. Goulet, thank you so much. I appreciate thank it. Thank you. Kenny, uh, I want, uh, excuse me, Kevin, <laughs> Kevin, I thought your version uh, kicked ass. Yes. I, I, I really do. And, and Howard, now. And Jeff, I want to thank you. You just came in here and tore it up, pal. Thank uh, you, Howard. Yeah, they were all three wonderful versions. Yes. That's what you got to say. Tom and Vinny, how do you feel about the outcome of the contest? I thought it was incredible. Well, if we had a chance to vote, who? Cool. Kevin. Kevin, all right, good. Okay. This is my birthday, and Mr. Goulet singing live. Incredible. Incredible for you. We did that for you. Did you ever dream that Robert Goulet would be singing your song? That and Robin bopping to it. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Gee, I tell you, I, I tell you, you all three. Yeah. yeah. Awesome. Incredible. Amazing. Incredible job. Incredible Talk job. about turd polishing. Would the, Would you consider uh, him as an artist? I'm being serious. Well, I, I'd, I'd have to put him in a room full of uh, people from Epic and from the A and R staff, but I think. Are you considering that? I think he deserves, you know. A serious audition because Absolutely. country music though is selling big these days, Absolutely. right? Absolutely. Yeah, John, you feel that way? I'm a publisher. He writes a good melody. Love right. to hear so, more and uh, see. We write more. a great All lyric. Right. You say, <laughs> Kevin. You say he deserves. <laughs> Saying he deserves more than a hemorrhoid applicator. How does that make you feel, Kevin? <laughs> Great. That's yeah, awesome. That's, that's, that's where good it for starts. you, pal. That's where it starts. Good job. good job. Got a good band there. Do they think anything of the other contestants? Yeah, seriously. Would you sign Mr. Goulet? I hope so. And I certainly hope you would sign uh, Jeff. I thought everybody did an excellent job. That's right. Well, Tom, you got your birthday wish. Mr. Goulet singing your song on your birthday. Thank you. Good for you. And uh, Mr. Goulet, thank you so much. Yeah, you were great. You're thank welcome. You. Yes, and, and uh, all you guys, great job. Hammer Relief, thank you for the $5,000.